Hello everyone, welcome to Examby. My name is Chandra Prakash Joshi. In this video, we are talking about two best jobs that is RBI and NAVAD. I am going to tell you the comparison between what you get at NAVAD, what is your career, what is your job profile versus what you get at RBI. Dr. Chintala, current chairman of the NAVAD, joined NAVAD as an officer as a postgraduate from IARA, Indian Agriculture Institute, Delhi. And if I tell you comparatively in RBI, there are three deputy governors who joined today, who joined as RBI grade B DR and today are deputy governors, Dr. Patra, Mr. M. R. Rao and Mr. T. Ravi Sankar. Almost of the same period, important is how you climb the ladder and more important is how you enjoy this journey. In this video, I will tell you how the career and life goes, what is the work profile functions and department of both the organizations and most important, how to utilize this opportunity. Right now, Nabad notice is there, join support as assistant manager. Assistant manager is grade A. You join as grade B means you are one level up, but if most of the recruitment happening as assistant manager, then there is equal opportunity. You can grow in the ladder. AGM is grade C and then you become TGM after promotion. That is senior management position and then general manager. After that, chief general manager. So that is the same journey in both RBI and NABAT. Then you become ED, executive director in NABAT. There is position of DMD, Deputy Managing Director after Executive Director, Managing Director and Chairman. Nabad is headed by a Chairman like RBA is headed by Governors. After Governors, there are four Deputy Governors, RBA grade B recruit reaches up to that level because Governor mostly is recruited from outside in RBI. This is how we grow. Now, Go little bit in detail. Suppose you are in Nabad, you will be at a grade A, grade B, grade C level. You will be a part of say potential credit linked plan. This is what you are making for a district. How finance, how credit can be used for development of agriculture and rural. In RBI, you may be part of the inspection. RBI is not showing the inspection reports. That's why I have nothing to show you here. These are kept top secret in Nabad, you will have opportunity to meet people in the field by promoting self-help groups and the offices are at state headquarters and head office in Mumbai in both. In RBI, you may be in currency management, this is a CVPS picture or you may be in any other department, I will come to that and offices are again in state capitals and head office in Mumbai. Understand what is NABAD. So NABAD is the national bank for fostering rural prosperity and guys let me tell you today a lot in rural is out of agriculture. Agriculture is important for rural economy but there are many non-agriculture activities if and the mission is to promote sustainable and equitable agriculture and rural development through participative financial and non-financial. There are some non-financial initiatives also which NABAD takes for the purpose of rural prosperity. In comparison to RBI, RBI is different. It's a central bank of the country and it is here to regulate the issuance of the notes, bank note, keeping of the reserve, the reserve of the country, forex with a view of securing monetary stability, that is the primary objective, generally to operate the currency and credit system of the country to its advantage to have a modern monetary policy framework to meet the challenges of increasingly complex economy to maintain price stability while keeping the objective of growth. So in today's situation when we are going through very very tough time, RBI is actually struggling how to maintain a good inflation means moderate inflation while keeping the objective of growth also in mind. While compare NABAT, which is a development financial institution. I will explain more when come to the department. NABAT grade A courses, the notification is available right now. I will tell you the difference in the exam pattern also. Here we are giving 
of 40 percent and today is the last day this is the opportunity and for RBI you can utilize this opportunity the function of NABAR when we compare that with RBI R NABAR provides finance and refinance finance for say food parks agriculture and rural project cold storage warehouses refinance refinance means when a lending institution has given a loan say a cooperative bank or RBI even a commercial bank and this loan is for a purpose which goes into NABAR's objective, say microfinance or a cold storage. NABAR provided refinance against that. NABAR also supervises, it mainly supervises, regulates some of the institution but primarily supervises the credit institution like rural cooperative and regional rural banks. In the case of RBI, if you compare the functions are RBI is the monetary authority. Monetary policy is framed by RBI and RBI is the regulator and super. Regulator means making the rule. Supervisor means ensuring that these rules are followed. For the financial system, primarily banking system, because certain parts goes with SEBI also. Manager of foreign exchange, Bideshi Mudra, Sari, RBI ke paas hai. Issuer of the currency, currency notes and then RBI also has developmental role. I will come to that when you talk about the department. Regulator of the payment and settlement system. This role is becoming more and more important as more and more payment companies are coming like Paytm or fintech companies are coming. RBI is bank to bank. Every bank opens account in RBI. RBI is also bank to the government. See primarily how it happens in the department in case of Nabat. There are departments like corporate planning department which will plan about how to do the finance refinance work in NABAD. DEAR, DEAR, DEAR is like DEPR and RBI, it is for economic analysis and research and then department of refinance, the refinance work is done there. DSM is department of storage and marketing. These storage and marketing are very, very important activities now because in agriculture, we need to create lot of warehouses. So Nabad has created separate department for it. Then department of supervision for supervision of cooperative and RRBs, farm sector development department and institutional development department. Uh, Nabad takes care of various rural institutions including Nabad has four or five subsidiaries. Microcredit innovation department is about the microfinance, self-help group lending program is a big initiative of Nabad which is done in help of, with the help of commercial banks. Then there are state project department, you must have heard about this RIDF, Rural Infrastructure Development Fund which NABAD manages. Paisa kaan se aata RIDF mein for the shortfall of the private sector lending, banks have to invest money in RIDF. So that money goes into various functions of NABAD including the state project department, department of financial inclusion and banking technology for promoting financial inclusion, strategic planning and product innovation department is a new one to use the technology for various innovations. In RBI, monetary policy department, we all know very, very important function, but all of you are not going to work there. I have discussed that in several videos. Department of regulation is about making the rule and department of supervision is about ensuring that rules are followed. Inspection work is done here in DBS. Currency management is about issuance of the note. Economic policy and research, DEPR. So this is about the policy of the country. I, the economic policy, I have, made, I have made another video on that. DEIO, Forex Reserve. So external investment and operations. The country's reserve is managed by this department, Department of Government and Bank Account. RBI is the banker to government and banks. DPSS is for regulating payment and settlement system. So these are the major one. Then there is department of inclusion and financial inclusion and development department FIDD. Financial market. So financial market means the liquidity in the market because all markets are linked. Forex market, equity market. For this there are two department. One is to manage operations and Regulation department is to make policy on that. Financial stability unit ensures that there is overall financial stability. Foreign exchange department 
FED is about the overall foreign exchange within the country. IDMD is internal debt means the debt which government borrows. Internal means the debt within the country, mainly state government and central government borrows with the help of IDMD. Risk monitoring department is for overall risk monitoring in the system. Consumer education and protection is for increasing the consumer education. Nowadays, a lot of financial crimes are happening. RBI, Kaita has series if you remember. These are the head offices, the board and RBI because where you are going to work. Mostly, you may be posted in head office in Mumbai in case of Nabad and regional offices are mostly in the state capitals. In some situations at grade B and grade C level, if you are posted, if it is not a mandatory posting, lead development manager is a coveted post, I would say because you represent the district at all the forums for the rural finance. This is done under the lead bank scheme of the government. Lead bank scheme, so actually NABARD person, the lead development manager of NABARD is very very important person here managing the overall finance in the district for agriculture and rural development. In case of RBI, there is no district level posting either in central office or in the regional offices. These, if you want to read in detail about the nature of work in NABARD, which is a read it and ask any question to me in the comment for the interest of time i am leaving it here for rbi i have made a separate video about pay perks promotion career and job profile you may watch this coming to the preparation part most challenging most difficult both job are great we have discussed that now what to do how to crack the exam point I am trying to communicate to you is see the similarity in the exam. There is difference also. See both. Because right now you have the bar notification there. Even if your aim is to become RBI grade B manager, though what is your aim, it depends. If you want to become a professional in the field of development finance and development finance is not only restricting at NABAD. If you see at the World Bank level, Asian Development Bank. So all all these institutions are doing development finance. There is a lot of work globally which is happening around eradicating poverty with the help of finance. So you can say Nabad is the apex institution in our country on that line. But coming to the exam, so here this English reasoning, computer knowledge, quantity aptitude decision making is qualifying you are going to be short so you have to score minimum here and what is that minimum that will be known only after the exam you have to score in general awareness economic social issues which focus in rural India that is the difference so when you are preparing for RBI ESI is there but in Nabad the focus will go more on the rural India agriculture and rural development with emphasis on rural India so this is very very important if you want to crack Nabad. In case of RBI, all have weight. The weight of general awareness is higher, but based on the total score out of these 200 marks, you will be qualifying phase 1. Interesting part is phase 2. So if you see uh, here, it is ARD also that clarification was given by Nabad later. In this, you have both the exam has descriptive answers also. So English is descriptive. Both the exam, RBI and NABAR. In case of ESI and ARD, so here you can see 50 marks is objective, 50 marks is descriptive and you have to study ARD and ESI. So overall, if you are in the preparation, so you have to ESI and ARD ki tayari karni hai. ESI is common in case of NABAD and RBI exam. In RBI exam, additional will be your FM, finance and management. And in case of the NABAD exam, agriculture portion will be extra, but the focus will be on rural economy. So data thoda rural side ka jada jayega. But your English descriptive is there, 50% of the weightage in both the exam. So you can understand when the job nature is so similar, 
the way pay box at the same label i'll come to that is same grid a label pe you can say the gross will be coming somewhere around 25000 to grid b pe it will be coming 85000 when this is so similar the postings are so similar the work profile has lot of similarity why not apply for nabad also right sebi also i have compared but today i am saying mostly about nabad because nabad notification is there we know nabad was carved out of rbi in 1982 taking some of the functions of the rbi to nabad therefore the culture the pay pug except the ddm the place of posting are also similar considering this opportunity does not it make a sense for we close will you give another one and half minute to hear sneha pande who is now an officer in nabad got selected last year hello friends my name is sneha pande and today i'm going to share with you my experience with exam b i'm a student of exam b from past one year and their guidance has helped me to crack nabad grade a and sbi junior associate examination 2019 I have also appeared in the phase 2 examination of IBPS PO and RBI grade B 2019. The best thing about I exam B is that its course content is very crisp and focused. The mock tests are of very good quality and contains a diversity of questions which helps us to broaden our perspective towards various concepts. The daily life classes gives us an opportunity to have one-on-one -on -one interaction with the faculty. and clear our doubts and understand the concepts in a better manner the daily ga capsules the weekly ga capsules and the monthly ga capsules has helped me a lot during my preparation and i was able to prepare my ga section really well whatever time i have spent with the i exam b courses or in the live classes of i exam b that was really fruitful and helped me in achieving my aim the faculty of i exam b is very helpful and approachable Whatever question we put to them, they revert back very promptly and with detailed explanation. So, friends, all of you who are aspiring for various kinds of bank jobs or jobs in NABARD, RBI, or SEBI, I would suggest you to opt I exam B courses and take full advantage of all the facilities which is provided in the uh, in I exam B platform. So, all the very best for your future. Thank. Don't forget to subscribe the channel and share the video. Best wishes.